where Dr. Lou is part of the Big Year Ender. Dr. Lou is here. He's got his Santa hat on. One of the uh, best moments for the football part of 2011. Dr. Lou, Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, cotton-headed ninny muggins. <laughs> it's, it's hard to believe, but guys, it's the big rear ender, which means Popo Zizo's workshop is busier than ever. <laughs> I must relay some discouraging news, though, from Chris Kringle. Oh, I'm no. sorry to Come report on, this. Lou. Spoke with Santa yesterday, and many of his little helpers are a little depressed right now. you got to be That's kidding right. me. Why is that? They are battling low elf esteem. <laughs> <laughs> oh, goodness gracious. I just wouldn't laugh a little bit this morning. <laughs> Guys, before we take off for Christmas break, I think it's time for us to get in the Christmas spirit with Carol's with the Cubs. Carols with Co- guys. I want to invite you to come along on the Luler Express for a Christmas adventure through the world of college football. We're looking at blizzard conditions, so bundle up and hold on tight. It's gonna be a crazy ride as always. Keep your hands inside the locomotive at all times. Chuck, 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 chuck. <laughs> oh, look, everyone, over there to your right, Bernie. The- Oh man, he's a jolly happy soul With corn on the cob and butter toast And two pies and dinner rolls <laughs> That was Vern Lindquist <laughs> <laughs> Oh wait, don't miss that over there to your left It's Urban the far pen slyer Had a very shaky heart So we retired from coaching and let out a stinky fart. <laughs> then Urban must have realized, I guess that was just bad gas. <laughs> now I'm gonna get back to coaching and everyone can kiss my honey. <laughs> Speaking of fo- former Florida Gators, <laughs> Pem Tebow, did you know that your baby boy would dominate the defenses? <laughs> Pem Tebow, did you know <laughs> that your baby boy would dominate the defenses and shove it in John Elway's his stupid face? And he, he's ridiculous beyond belief. Even Bill Romanowski has a 13-year-old schoolgirl crush on him. <laughs> Pam Tebow, did you know? <laughs> hey, look, another Heisman Trophy has to say quarterback. Get over here, Cam Newton. Let me get some hot, hot, hot chocolate, hot, hot, hot chocolate, hot, hot, hot chocolate, hot, hot. Everybody now, hot, 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 hot chocolate, hot, hot, hot chocolate, hot, hot, hot chocolate, hot chocolate. There's another Auburn guy. Hey, Gene Chesky, what do you want for Christmas? All I want for Christmas is to coordinate horses, to coordinate horses, to coordinate horses. All I want for Christmas is to coordinate horses, and then all I'd have to buy is a quarterback. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, is this locomotive on fire? No, wait, that's smoke coming from Calvin Speedy Wilburn. Hey! <laughs> Speedy's up. He wants the smoke. Hey! <laughs> you got a light. Give him a toast. <laughs> Simply having a wonderful nicotine break. <laughs> Simply having a wonderful nicotine break. <laughs> Guys, there's nothing like Christmas in the South, is there? Especially in Tuscaloosa. Down in Alabama, there's trailer parks galore. <laughs> We've got 13 national championships, but all we want one more. But we'll have to beat on Leslie to take the title home. And I swear friends get up one time during that game and get food. My head is gonna blow. <laughs> Merry Christmas from Nikki. <laughs> I'm shorter than an L. <laughs> Merry Christmas from Nikki. <laughs> Merry Christmas, Sister Heinie's bad love <laughs> in your seats, cause we don't get to eat hot dogs like you do. That's to explain the rest of the song. Okay, what's that, Nicholas? You have a song for the Auburn fans. Oh, boy. 42 to 14. 42 to 14. <laughs> 42 to 14. 
that is the score that we beat your team. <laughs> now we're gonna play for our 14th title. And no, I'm not talking about a state <laughs> title. I'm talking about a national title. So enjoy your cow eat more chicken bowl. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, how did Aaron Neville get on this train? <laughs> Bells will be ringing. Sunsets over Christmas. Soon the blues. Well, thanks, Aaron. Now let's take a trip to Kansas to talk to their administrators. We got a Charlie Potamus for Christmas. It's <laughs> only Charlie Potamus will do. We tried to use a coach that weighed less than a ton, but clearly that didn't work out by the number of games he won. So we hired a coach as big as Mark Mangino. <laughs> oh, so he could fit in his stuff too. <laughs> Speaking of Charlie Weiss, what's that, Charlie? You want to sing out your entire Christmas list? All I want for Christmas is food. <laughs> that was it. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, that was nice, guys. I have a little uh. Christmas list of my own. I'd like to share it. <laughs> Sir, I want to buy these two laces for Denard Robinson. <laughs> it's Christmas Eve and his shoes don't have any shoelaces. That's why they call him Shoelace, because he doesn't have any shoelaces. So I figured that I'd get some shoelaces for his shoes and and so he would have some shoelaces, and no one would call him shoelace again. Denard, what's that you're saying? I hope the, I hope the fat boys catch this one. You have a secret to tell us about LSU coach Leslie Miles. We'll spill the beans. I saw Leslie kissing Nancy Lopez. <laughs> <laughs> Or at least it looked just like no Nancy Lopez's twin. Has anybody seen? Has anybody seen Leslie Miles' wife? Uh, I figured it was a gamble, but I tried it anyway. And speaking of Leslie Miles, let's sing an LSU Tiger favorite. Let's smoke some weed, let's buy some weed, let's buy some weed, let's smoke some weed. Bunch of military person in the face, bunch of military person in the face. Let's buy some weed, let's smoke some weed, let's smoke some weed, let's, some weed. let's smoke some weed. Please pass me the bong. Guys, let's finish up here. Bill Bubba Bussy, oh. you got one for us? I think we're out of time, sir. <laughs> Jesse Bono. <laughs> Take a look at the ties and ten jiggle it once again and back in the acrylic paint, you know. I'm beginning to look a lot like Jesse. <laughs> we even have the same hair. But one thing that makes me unique is something which I cannot speak. We have different underwear. 